God. <laughs> Ward 7, 7, all... Ward 7, 7 Alderman William Bill Shea won his record 41st consecutive term. The 116-year-old Alderman, the, illeg the illegitimate offspring of former Secretary of the Navy Frank Knox and his Irish maid Bridget Shea, was first elected to the board during the Democratic sweep of 1933. Eighty-two years later, Shea crushed his opponent, despite being limited to only campaigning at night. Queen City citizens with long member, memories will remember that Shea, who was a corporal in the Yankee division during the Great War, was stationed in Transylvania after the cessation of hostilities on November 11, 1918. He was bitten in the private parts while visiting a brothel by a prostitute who turned out to be Dracula's daughter. A quick-thinking patron saved Corporal Shea's life by taking him immediately to a local moil. Now, for viewers not of the Jewish persuasion, a moil is a ritual circumciser. Snip, 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 snip. Upon returning to Manchester after being demobilized, Bill Shea was able to lead a surprisingly robust life, given that he was now technically a vampire. His good health reportedly was the result of blood transfusions obtained from frequent trips to the Red Cross blood bank. Alderman Shea today set yet another record when Mike Lopez, chair of Manchester's Veterans Council, announced that the centenar centenarian, Joel, you should really help me with that one, the centenarian would once again be the Grand Marshal of the Veterans Day Parade for the 41st consecutive year. 41 consecutive terms as Alderman, 41 consecutive years as Grand Marshal of the Veterans Day Parade. Can those records ever be bested? The political grapevine says that whoever wants to beat Bill Shea and become Ward 7 Alderman would be better relying on a wooden stake rather than the ballot box. Eek have I.